Letterman and 19-year-old Antonin Imo. 12th up to the river dance. The coach and choreographed by Barbara Piton. Another new team by Letterman and Anthony Imo from Switzerland. And they, like some of the others, will be really keen to secure that Junior World's minimum tech score. They just narrowly missed out by less than half a point in the rhythm dance. So that'll be a big coup for them if they can get it. And it's interesting, they're quite a tall couple, but have beautiful long lines. And you can see them use that space as they reached up and stood up straight. And, and their choreography is designed to strategically use those long lines. Well done. Here's a look at the twizzles. They have a, a senior look about them. Well, to see how little time they've been together, well matched. You can barely see Mael behind Antonin and the twizzles there from the angle of the judges. Difficult entry into straight line lift. That's forcing the judges to give good grade of execution. 
Wasn't sure about the character step in regards to the placement on the ice. I was a bit concerned that they deviated too far. Yeah. From but it's gone in. So, no doubt from the tech panel. And this, the stationary lift, which is coming in just at level two. Not sure if the difficult features were retained or established. But I think certainly a team that should attain that 38 points for the minimum technical element score for Junior Worlds. They were, like I say, four tenths of a point off in the rhythm dance, but looking much stronger here. Well, you can tell that there's still a young developing team. There's still lots of work to do on skating skills, power and speed, and ice coverage and whatnot, and just comfort. I mean, although they did a good job with where they're at, they still need to get a little comfortable with the couple and, uh, uh, you know, within the program. But certainly, look at how straight they're sitting. So they have wonderful backs, mm -hmm. great posture, <laughs> good lines. It's lots and of good stuff to work with. Yeah, and if, if you go with kind of stereotypical ideal, they've got a, a great height match as well limb lengths are good so if you go kind of really archaic kind of what would be optimal then they've got a great starting point aesthetically what did you say about archaic what do you mean archaic? well it's like the old ice dance <laughs> the old you know, ice dance. okay there you go <laughs> <laughs> yeah. i mean and you know we've got so many teams in the world now that dispel that idea of you know you have to be a certain height difference mm -hmm. from your partner yeah. and you gotta be um but you know you play to your strengths and they've got long limbs and yeah. if they make Exactly. Shapes with those long limbs, looks good. You know, it doesn't matter. The teams can all be successful, whatever. Let's take a look at the free dance scores. 70.83 for Mael and Antonin, second in the free dance. With the total competition score, 113.76, and that will put them for the moment overall into second place.